Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, hello. My name is Shauna Marshall, and welcome to my little corner of the internet where I create Sims 4 Let's Plays. I already know you're gonna enjoy your time here, so please make sure to hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload a video. One step forward, two steps backwards, yeah. And much your lover who don't use big words, yeah I don't need commenting at all because I know what I want Baby, can't you figure it out what's going on in your heart? Hey guys, we're back with another episode of Rags to Riches. So in this episode, we will be um, redecorating her apartment. So I will be selling all of the furniture that's in the apartment and then... Um, purchasing the tiny living furniture tiny home living whatever that stuff pack or pack whatever the pack was whatever it was called so i i have it i purchased it when it first came out and i don't think i've ever used it so this will be a good time for me to put it all to good use so i will be um adding other things in the house possibly if we don't run out of money um, but I do like that little pack set and I've absolutely never used it. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and get into decorating her apartment. I hope you guys enjoy. You don't care what you're doing to me. I've been down in the ruins so deep. All the games that you play, all the love you've forsaken, you let it slip away. So we are done decorating her apartment. Everything is in there. I think it looks pretty good. Of course, it doesn't have any CC. Well, it does. The kitchen and bathroom. But the bedroom and her little loft area does not. So we're going to go on in there and take a look. Um, it is nothing but the uh, tiny living furniture. That's it. So. You first walk in, of course, we got the kitchen. Y'all know we saw this already. So we saw everything. I did not put anything in the kitchen because my girl funds was running low. So we just kept the kitchen as is. You know what? She may not be able to get in the refrigerator with this. So I may have to delete that because she don't have no wall space. And I don't want to put it over the stove i don't know if that'll be a good idea so i may have to sell that that may not work but anyway so then you come on around over child you come on around over here and you got her living room area so we got her tv she got her new couch um little plants hanging all that good stuff you know i should have bought her some curtains but again funds was low so we'll try that out next time um so and then let's turn around and let's look at her room so this is just her room we have to put the bed down so you know that this bed can go we can put it up or put it down so i'm gonna have her come in and put her bed down and we can keep it down um we don't have to put it back up so yeah i think it's cute i think it's cute definitely not uh what i normally would do but for story's sake, I think this is good. This is furniture that she could have definitely gotten for really cheap. And, you know, she's just going to make this little place home. So we're going to have her come on in. The first thing I want her to do is put this bed down because I do want to see what it looks like. Because uh, I was not able to see that. So come on in here, girl. Stop being scared. Just get in here and then you don't have to be scared. Okay, so come on. 
Okay, she likes it. Yay. Nicely. De oh, decorated from good environment. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, so this is the bed. All right, nothing, nothing crazy, nothing fancy. Why is this going through the wall? Do I have it going through the wall like that? Child, let me fix this. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I pulled it out. So now let's have her put it down again. I also sold uh, that little thing over there that I was blocking the refrigerator and I bought her some blinds. So, okay, there we go. That's a little better. Okay, girl, and then you could just leave it down because there's we have no reason to put it up. Um, and then I just got her this little desk area, you know, for when we make enough money and we can afford a computer, it can go there. Uh, let me see. When do she have to go back to work? So she has to go to work. Oh, she's off. She's off because it's the weekend. Okay. All right. So what we can do, um, let's invite... Let's see. Who can we invite over now? My girl got a place. Okay. Um, let's see. I want to invite some of the girls over. But probably just Skylar. Like her and Skylar really hit it off. And then this Roy guy. Remember Roy that she met at the the gym? I think we're going to get to know Roy too. Uh, so let's see. But for now, let's just invite Skylar over. Uh, and maybe Justine. Maybe we'll invite Justine and we'll invite Skylar. So let's invite her to hang out and we're going to invite Skylar. Lock the camera. Skylar, girl, are you here? Where's she at? Skylar's here. A little bit of that's a little stalkerish. I mean, but hey. All right. So let's control her. Not you being flirty. Oh my goodness. Were you about to be go to somebody's house? If so, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, so let's have Skylar come in here and have a seat. Okay, and then what did what did Justine say? Is she coming? Justine will be right over. Yay! Okay. So who is this? Anybody here? Oh, I thought somebody was here. Okay, Skylar's on her way. And then I guess Justine is probably on her way too. Are you coming here, girl? Not you. Girl. And she looking right at this apartment. You passing the apartment, sweets? Sit Sam's here? No. No. Call her. Can you, like, call her over here? Like, invite her in or something. So she knows that she can come in. Not insult. Macy, baby. <laughs> Why is that, like, the first thing that pops up? Like, the girl the girl just got, has to get it together. Um, Okay, ask about her day. And then maybe I can get her to come in and once you do that. And is Justine here? Justine, why you... Well, now, why'd she go to the laundry room? Like, I know that that area is shared, but girl, come on. Not her want to fight. Okay, but don't come, don't come. I should really get going. Oh, well, Skylar said, nah, bro, I'm good. Okay, Skylar, maybe another day. Justine never knows what is lurking in the dark. Darkness is nothing but a veil to hide the most gruesome. Oh, child, is our door um, locked? While I'm trying to invite people over. Jesus. My fault, Justine. Come on in, girl. And hold on. Macy, you're scared. But you ran outside. Girl. Get in the house. Okay, can we get her to... Come sit down now? Steady sit. No. You. Can you go in there now? The door is unlocked. Girl, the door is unlocked. Okay, you know what? You you take your butt home. And where is you? Now, why are you going to sit there, Justine? Why are you going to sit there? 
Okay, but anyway, let's let's talk to Justine. Let's see how she been doing. Uh, not argue about career. We don't need to do that. I mean, she don't even have a career. Technically, she's still in school. Try to console. What's wrong? She like, Justine, girl, what's wrong? Why are you looking so sad? Macy said, what the hell wrong with you, girl? Calm down. Macy said, it's not that deep. Not you walking through the refrigerator. Where did she? Where is she going? So everybody just leaving my girl? Like is this what's happening? Like I'm trying to have y'all over here to have a conversation. <gasps> did she? Oh my god girl that was closed. Yeah you better run your butt inside. Because that was close. You want to stand outside like a crazy person. Girl, go inside. These sims be so psychotic. So psychotic. And look at her. Look at her. Come and sit down, girl. Come and sit down. Like, let you... I'm about to say, you better not go outside. Child. Oh. <laughs> what is wrong with them? She said, girl, it is too crazy outside today. I can't even believe I came out. She was like, I mean, I've been trying to get Skylar over here, but she did not come. I don't know where she is. She was like, girl, you know Skylar's probably not going to come over here. Skylar's too busy, like, doing work and studying. Macy's like, man, I wish that was me. She like, yeah, I got some homework and stuff that I need to do, too. She was like, so I'm just going to sit here and do my homework. She was like, you go so you just going to do your homework in front of me? Uh -huh. She like, Really? You know I got kicked out. Uh, she said I wanted to take over the world. And I made one mistake and they kicked me out. And here you is sitting here doing your homework in front of me. Rocking to the beat. Look how Macy looking. Macy be looking like she could just kick somebody's butt. The way she be looking at these people. Macy, I don't know. Justine, Justine bigger than you. You probably need to calm it down. Yeah, have a nice conversation with her. There you go. Meanwhile, Ju Justine, where you going? You okay, Macy? She like, girl, what is wrong with you? Why are your hands spinning? She said, you need to be trying to get back into school. She said, look, I'm trying. She like, but I don't have no money for school. She was like, okay, well then apply for some more scholarships and let's see if you get it. She like, yeah, I guess I can try. She like, girl, you can't give up. You need to just try to get back into school so you can finish. She was like, it's already been a few months. Maybe they'll let you in on probation or something. She was like, or either that, just go to the army. <laughs> Macy's like, I'm not going to the army. Justine is like, your anger can go there. She was like, girl, I'm not going to the army. I'm not doing that. Justine was like, okay, well then go and apply for another scholarship and see if you can get, you know, some money for school. Macy's like, yeah, I guess I could, but I mean, I got this job now. Justine said, well, you're going to have to try to do it all, girl. Anyway, I'm hungry. What you got in here to eat? J Macy's like, you do know I'm broke, right? I don't have no money to buy you no food. He was like, you better go and get you some coffee or something. Justine, like, you a terrible house guest. <laughs> okay, maybe Justine is right. Let's see if my girl can apply for some scholarships. Give notice in writing? Nah, we just moved in. So, let's see. We're going to apply for some scholarships and let's see if we are able to... Oh my God, this weather. See if we're able to get any. So... Okay. So, they have the building, the future. We don't... We already know we're not getting that. Workplace scholar. Sims who have shown success in any career can apply for the career force. I mean, we, we haven't been on the job long, but guess what? We're going to apply. We're going to apply. Yes, we are. 
Okay. Justine's leaving? No. Um, Sam's with really low household funds will be eligible to apply for this scholarship and is. Let's do it. She's like, bye, Macy. Macy's like, you know what? I just don't even have time. Um, okay, girl. We had one more. What did that one say? Uh, Newcrest resident. Okay. All right. Well, we're living in Newcrest, so we are also uh, going to apply for that one as well. Okay, period. All right. Now, y'all, if we get our scholarships, we're going to say that they enrolled us back into school on a probationary period. I know that that really don't happen, but my girl wants to be in college. Like, she wants to be in college. Or, you know what? No, 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 no. What I'm about to have her do is we're going to enroll for the, at the other university. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to apply again. And she can no longer go to Howard. We're going to say she's going to go to a community college. Or not like a community. She's going to go to a college, not a university. That makes sense. That's what we're going to do. All right. So did that. Now we're going to wait to see if we get our acceptance letter. In the meantime, girl, let's come in here. Let's use the restroom. Because my girl is like, I really do not want to spend the rest of my life working no dead end job. She's always wanted to go to school. So she is just trying to test like all of her options. But she's still going to have to keep her job because that's the only way we're bringing in money. So my girl is going to have to take classes after one. Oh my God, I hope we can do that. Because, you know, we can never choose the time of our classes. So hopefully it goes by like it sees that she has a job. So it'll put all of her classes like late in the evening. Girl. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. You want to get in there and cry again. Okay, let's uh, serve some dinner. We need to go to the grocery store. So we're going to go to the grocery store um, when we get our money up because we, we ain't got no money. We have no money. Uh, let's do fish and tacos because it's only $18. Get your butt out this bed. Not me not seeing the bed. Oh, I need to get the laundry uh, basket. I got to get her a laundry basket real quick. Like, oh my God, y'all, my girl barely had enough for her freaking uh, laundry basket. My goodness, but hopefully, now that we got our house, our girl will start putting a little bit of weight on her because she is just so little. What is this? Now, who told you to do camper stew? Well, maybe that's all she had. She's like, that's all I got. And then it's poor quality. Y'all, look at this. Look at this. Macy, baby, you couldn't do no better than that. And we are definitely not throwing it away because we don't have no money to spare. So you go eat it. I'm so sorry. And then we need to save up some money for her to, um, you know, get on birth control because my girl is going to be starting living. Okay. She has, you know, already been, then you started it. So that means they charged us. You know what, Macy? You get on my nerves. You really get on my nerves. Let's go ahead and sell that because clearly we need that $60. Why you over here playing? Sell. So it really don't want, it, it's not going to let me sell. Okay, there you go. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't sell this. Okay, let's pull that out. We can use this. I don't know when, but we can. All right, move that cum board over there so you can clean that. Hey, mama, look at us. We making, we are making progress, girl. All right, I'm going to let her finish this, get some sleep. We're going to wake up tomorrow, and maybe we'll call that guy Roy over. All right, y'all, my girl is woke, and as soon as we wake up, we get this. I got a lucrative opportunity for someone who doesn't ask too many questions. I need you to hold on to a stack of simoleons. I'm planning to launder until the trail uh, turns cold. Sure, it may not be legal or moral, but it'll help line your pockets. You in? Oof. My girl need the money, y'all. But she's also trying to get back into school and she hasn't. No, we're not going to do it.
my first mom was like yup yup because she just making bad decisions on top of bad decisions but no we're not gonna do it okay girl go use it what is wrong with your <gasps> i know you fr by who bitch by who you ain't been with nobody by who yeah do i have a pregnant it doesn't even give me the option to Maybe she just thinking about it, right? She just thinking, right? Well, you can think again, because it ain't going to happen. Go to the bathroom. What the hell was... Macy, go to the bathroom, because you done stressed me out. That has really stressed me. All right. Um, right. I'm all discombobulated now. I don't know what to do. Uh, Whoops, sorry, girl. I'm trying to get to the sink. All right, go brush your teeth. Yeah, yeah, wash wash your hands. All that other stuff. What Justine want? Guess what? My date, Manami, went very... My date with Manami went very well. Okay, girl, congrats. We are happy for you. Okay, you get done with that. Let's wash your face. And then we are going to get in the shower so you need to take a shower why is that unlocked that's weird okay is she hungry not really but we do need to clean up all right girl go ahead jump in the shower so you can get out so we can clean our apartment yay i'm so happy she got an apartment y'all it's a little but it's big enough for her it's just her you out? Okay, period. That was quick. Now let's clean up this little stinking place. Because it's too little to be stinky. It's too little. Law. Property owner visit. The property owner is here for a visit. So? My, we don't need him, bro. Where is you going? Girl, I didn't give you no trash. Well, guess what? We don't have no money. So, yep, walk to the dumpster. It's right here. It's not far. It's not far. So, we just going to have to use this. Yep. Why is this little girl outside? Why? Why is this little girl outside of our uh place? Macy looked at her like, what you want? Please go away. <laughs> yes, girl. All right. Clean, 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 clean. All right, this Roy dude really don't know us, but um, I still want to see if he will come over. So let's just see. So let's invite him to hang out. Let's see if he'll come over, girl. And her uh, little friend that she got. I forgot his name. I think we should skip the getting to know each other part and just preferably right now. No, you creep. So I'm assuming that you are the property owner, but we don't care. We invited Roy over and he came. Now her getting flirty when he get here. Bro, Roy is like, what's up? I didn't think you would ever invite me over. I remember you. She was like, yeah, I just wanted to invite you over. I just moved into a new place. So I thought it would be fun to get to know people. So I really wanted to just, you know, invite you over. Get to know you a little bit. <gasps> Bro, calm down, Macy. Nothing tying me down from single and loving and lifestyle. There's nothing like the sweet smell of independence after a nice long sleep. Macy loves waking up single. I mean, girl, we can be single, okay? Just call me Cupid. Give Macy a bow and arrow. Cupid has competition now? Child, like the way she went for Roy. Let me see. Let me see. Then he's perceived as unattractive. But she like, listen, I want one thing. 
She like, I just want that one thing. Like, I don't care what you look like. Girl, but we don't got no birth control. But you know what we can do? We can buy condoms. Because I really want her to actually, like, do the realistic thing with going to the doctor before she gets on, you know, birth control. But we don't have to do that when it comes to condoms. We could just go to the store. So we're going to Instacart. <laughs> Can we Instacart that? I really don't know. All right. These two are done. Y'all want to come out the bathroom now? She's like, he's like, so back to you moving in. When did you move in? She's like, I told you I moved in like a day ago. She's like, anyway, I've worked up an appetite. So I'm about to go in here and cook something to eat. Because I'm not about to let her have that leftovers. Like... Hopefully, she can fix some lunch and not mess it up. I mean, a BLT girl, how hard is that? Like, how hard is that? Come in here and let's try to do that. She's like, yeah, I'm about to go and fix lunch, though. <gasps> it's her. What? It's Royce. Oh, my God. He. I should really get going. Not him leaving after what? But you left your, you 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 left something. You, you left something. Since when was this a thing where they leave their panties? And why is he? Why does he wear a G string? I mean, he could be like a muscle builder. He's he looks like the type. He could be a muscle builder. Maybe that's why. But, bro, I don't even think they were that. Like, why are you? You know, I'm done. You know, to, hey, to each their own. Arm boy. Girl. <gasps> Macy. Macy stressed me out is what y'all don't know. Okay, girl, this better not be poor quality. Okay, excellent quality. Exactly. Thank you. And what can we do with this? What exactly can you do with that? You can make hot cocoa. <laughs> Panties acquired. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, you have to repair it? It's broken? Okay, well, we can repair it. Where, where did you eat it? Girl, if you don't come in here and sit down. Why are you eating in the bathroom? You could have picked that out when you got done. Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay, girl. Anyway, first day in her house has been a success so far. So far, like everything went good with Roy. Even though I don't even think she cared about him leaving because she probably was like, all right, bye. Okay, and then let's come and repair this. Like, we can use this. Let's repair it. We're going to clean it. And then I'm pretty sure, like, this will come in handy for us. Okay, so I think she's fixed this now. Not you want to dance. Okay, so now can we clean this, though? We need to clean it because it's nasty before we talk about using it. All right, has our mail been delivered? Because I want to see if we got into school. It has not. Okay. <sighs> we just have to be patient. We have to be patient. That's fine. Okay, girl. Now let's uh, boil. Get in here. Boil it. Okay. So how we know when it's done? I guess it'll beep or something, right? You going to watch TV? Where you going? You just going to listen to music? Okay, that's fine. Oh, it's green. Okay, so we can do coffee, hot cocoa, tea, and hot water. So let's do <gasps> calming chamomile. I feel like you need that at night. Healthy green. Let's do the healthy green because you stay sick.
You have made a payment of eight dollars toward interaction, huh? Uh, uh huh. What? I gotta pay to use this or something? What you talking about? Is it good? I think she likes it. Period. All right, girl, come sit down and enjoy your cup of tea. Enjoy your cup of tea. All right, y'all. I think right there is a good place to go ahead and wrap up this episode. I definitely hope that you guys enjoy. Make sure to let me know what do y'all think about her new little decor in her apartment now that we did the tiny home living furniture. Um, also, tell me what y'all think about Roy. Like, Roy came over and apparently she was really feeling him, but she thinks he's unattractive. I don't know. So, but he may be somebody that just comes over to keep her company so hopefully uh when we get back to work my girl needs to save us some money so we can go to the doctor so we can put her on some birth control but for now she has her condom so we should be all good fingers crossed because y'all know my game hates me but pregnancy and macy is something that will not be happening because my girl can barely take care of herself but yeah so her with pregnancy i definitely don't think that's gonna happen right now not for her but anyway y'all let me know down in the comments below what y'all thought about this episode make sure to hit that like button hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell and i will see you guys next week with a brand new episode bye guys